Good UAV. I'm one away. I'm gonna push up. I'm gonna push up. Are you? Destroy the objective. How did that kill me? I'm EOD! What's going on guys and welcome back to Modern Warfare 3. And as y'all can see, man, season one has officially begun. We have so much content. I'm not even gonna lie. This might be one of the greatest seasons we've had in the past few Call of Duties. And as y'all can see, my operator is insane. But of course, man, we got two brand new maps. We got Greece as well as Meat. We also have a whole new battle pass, which I'm definitely gonna go through. New DLC weapons, a brand new assault rifle, the Ram 7, as well as a brand new sniper. And of course, the brand new Warzone experience is also here. And of course, man, with all this new content, I have to hook you guys up with the battle pass. If you guys want the battle pass, make sure to drop a like on today's video and let me know in the comments section your Twitter or Instagram and also what console you play on. So before we jump into any gameplay, let's just jump into this battle pass and just, you know, showcase what's inside. So for sector one, we got the melee charm. We also have cryo freeze ammo mod actually for zombies, which is really damn good. We also got some double XP, which is definitely needed for these new weapons, a new calling card, and a brand new MCW variant. And of course, guys, Black Cell is back. So of course, if you own Black Cell, like the Battle Pass expansion, you will get even more variants. And honestly, they look really damn good. Vector A2, we get another emblem. We also get, ooh, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, this actually might be one of the coolest things we have gotten in this Battle Pass. You guys can actually see this gun is fully animated. It's almost like this black type of vibe and the magma comes through. That's crazy. We also get another operator skin as well as a black cell version. Vector A3, we get a brand new uh, sniper rifle variant for the KV inhibitor, some double XP, COD points, and another, of course, uh, skin right here. And also here is the black cell version. Ethereum crystals for zombies? I'm glad zombies is actually getting some love in this battle pass for sure. Some more double XP. We also got some emblems, some decals, and at A4, we get the brand new sniper. This is the XRK Stalker, and I've heard some amazing things about this weapon. Sector A5, we get a variant here uh, for the TYR handgun. We also get another skin, another weapon charm, some COD points, a vehicle skin. And at Sector A7, you get the Ram 7, which is a returning gun from Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2019. I remember this assault rifle being pretty mid, pretty average. It wasn't anything spectacular, so obviously we'll see probably later on in the video how this is. And a marksman rifle variant right here. We also have another operator skin for Doc. A9, we just get some uh, emblems, some charms, a gutter knife melee blueprint, which doesn't really look that crazy. Ooh, at A10, we get another style of like this magma variants. This is really cool. Honestly, I'm glad they're doing this type of stuff uh, for the battle pass because I feel like a lot of the battle pass rewards aren't really ever that great. Another black cell uh, skin and operator and stuff like that. Ooh, A12, we get one for the Bass B battle rifle rifle, which is honestly a pretty popular gun. Oh yeah, we also have a brand new launcher in this season called the Storm Mender. And I'm pretty sure the sole purpose of this launcher is just to destroy enemy equipment like bouncing Bettys and Claymores, but it can actually kill people. Some more COD points, some more double XP. We love that. Oh, we got some more variants as well. We got the DM-56 Marksman Rifle, again with this whole magma type vibe. And also we get a brand new aftermarket part, the Jack Purifier. Actually a brand new flamethrower attached that can be equipped to a lot of different weapons in this game. So I have no idea if this is overpowered or not. We get a WSP variant. We also get some COD points, some more XP. I, I honestly love all this XP. So we get blueprints for the XRK Stalker, the brand new sniper rifle. And here is the Black Cell version. Oh my God. We get a Lockwood 680 variant. We get, oh my, wow, oh my gosh. The Black Cell stuff is actually kind of lit. So we get a Lockwood 680 variant and we also get some really good Black Cell skins. Once again, the Black Cell skins are kind of nice. At tier 18, you get a Holger 556 variant. Here's the Black Cell version. And then here is the regular version. A couple more variants here. Another Black Cell skin. We also get a Ram 7 blueprint. And then also here is the Black Cell version. And then we get some COD points. We get an MTZ blueprint right here. And then this is the tier 100 skin. And also here is 
the Black Cell version. And then if you buy Black Cell, you get a little bit of more rewards and stuff like that. Some different skins, some more blueprints. Overall, in my opinion, the Battle Pass is really, really good. It's been upgraded a lot from the previous years. You get a lot of awesome blueprints and rewards. All right, man, I think it's time. We have to check out this Ram 7. Fellas, and I had to try out the new map, Greece, as well. And I'm not even gonna lie. This map is bright, has good colors. I'm kind of down. I think you can also use the water as well to kind of like reposition and get around the map. So that should be pretty interesting. Overall, I'm really, really excited to... uh Okay, die. I, I'm sure that's what I'm excited for. And also, if you guys didn't know, a few content creators got invited to the Sledgehammer Studios like a week ago uh, to basically get hands-on with season one content early and upload it to the channel. Now, I actually got invited to that, but I actually could not make it because I was already traveling for the holidays and Thanksgiving, so... I actually couldn't make it to the Sledgehammer Studios, but I definitely would have gotten you guys some early content for Season 1. Just kind of looking at the new maps and, you know, stuff like that. New weapons early. This is 12v12, um, which is really, really good. I'm glad that 12v12 is on this new map because this new map is kind of on the, kind of on the larger side for sure. All right, we got this guy right here. I don't know what the vibes are. Oh, that guy just died. This map extends. Am I dead? So I can hit this water, right? Yeah, I can. Hit this water spot. Maybe try and flank around? Wow. Oh my god. No! Okay. Oh my gosh. No! Bro, they're spawning from behind us now. Okay, UAV counter. This guy at top. Oh. Whole team's on me. Oh my god. I'm on a 14, guys. fellas we got the ram 7 and we're playing on my me all right this is apparently one of the smallest maps egg ever oh my god or just in mw3 and this is only 6v6 as well so like you know i i, I think oh my god wait there's people behind me there's people on the hard point what oh i could already tell this is going to be absolutely just insane oh my gosh all right well we're rocking the ram 7 as well wait someone tried to snipe me Wow. wow. Wait, people are spawning behind me, like on, on top of me pretty much. Wait, 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 there's another dude here. Wait, are we good? Wh what is going on? Uh, teammates need help probably. There's one dude. Are we good? I'm, I'm, bro, I'm basically... I'm basically watching these guys spawn, like... Okay, the Ram 7 is just like, it's just okay right now i'm not sure i definitely need to like find the best setup for this gun for sure this guy's gonna push if like three people push me right now i'm dead wow i'm so surprised i just got that kill okay we're one kill away we're one kill away from a advance needed that needed that advance like right now okay There's a guy with like ghosts. Gotta be careful here. Is the guy still here? 
This guy just pushed up. He was like in the corner. A lot of 15. We just gotta play our angles right now. We have to play our angles. Oh my god, bro. This is gonna be so tough. This is gonna be really, really tough. Oh, these spawns. As you guys can see with the advance, you can really see how the spawns work. And not, not the greatest, man. Like, look at that spawn. Okay, now we don't have an advance. I want to drop on meat. I want to drop on my meat, but... I'm on a 23. We got to get out of there. The spawns are just not in our favor right now. They keep spawning down that long hallway. I'm also getting a call on my goddamn phone. Who's calling? I had to end the call. I literally just had to end the call. What? I'm on a 25. 26. Bro, they're calling me again. They're spam calling me. I'm on a 27. I unlocked a camo. Hello? I'm on a 28. Good UAV. I'm one away. I'm gonna push up. I'm gonna push up. Are you? Destroy the objective. How did that kill me? I'm EOD.